the former U.S. Uh, uh, ambassador to China, getting back to the tensions with North Korea. Uh, former U.S. ambassador to China, Gary Locke, is with us this morning. And ambassador, it's good to have you on the program this morning. Thanks so much for joining us. Good to be with you, Maria. So, what, good what to be is with you. your reaction to President Trump's meeting with President Xi? Uh, and what can China do? Do you think they'll be willing to help the U.S. Uh, to rein in North Korea? Well, I was very pleased with the meeting between the two presidents because they were really uh, uh, had an opportunity to get to know each other, understand the priorities and concerns of each a country. And certainly President Trump indicated that North Korea was a major issue for America. And it's been really great to see that China, uh, over the last several years, starting under President Obama, has in fact supported tough U.N. sanctions against North Korea. Uh, of course, North Korea has, uh, uh, has to be brought to the table, has to stop its nuclear development. And China, quite frankly, has to do even more than what it has done before. It's also gratifying to see that just within the last week or so, uh, China has turned back uh, cargo ships coming from North Korea. Uh, where it would be selling coal to China. And so I think that China is beginning to uh, understand just how dire the situation is and is, in fact, putting even more pressure on North Korea. China holds the key to negotiations and ensuring that uh, North Korea stops develop developing its nuclear weapons. So here